Meghan Markle loses it. Prince Harry's devastating news about the Diana Award snub in New York City. In the whirlwind world of royalty, where every gesture is scrutinized and every word dissected, news about Meghan Markle and Prince Harry never fails to capture attention. Recently, the couple found themselves at the center of a media storm following a shocking revelation about the Diana Award, a prestigious humanitarian honor established in memory of Princess Diana. The latest development not only sent shockwaves through their fan base, but also sparked discussions about the couple's ongoing struggles with their royal legacy. Let's dive into this captivating saga and uncover why Meghan Markle reportedly lost it over this news. But before we continue, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more updates. Princess Diana, beloved by millions around the globe, is remembered for her charity work and her ability to connect with people from all walks of life. The Diana Award, founded in her honor in 1999, celebrates young people who have made a significant impact in their communities. It embodies her spirit of compassion and commitment to service. For Harry, the award carries profound significance as it reflects his mother's values and his own aspirations to make a difference. However, the recent news surrounding the award has left many, including Meghan Markle, reeling. Reports emerged that the couple was snubbed from a high-profile event in New York City celebrating the Diana Award. This unexpected oversight sparked a range of emotions, particularly for Meghan, who has often been vocal about her admiration for Princess Diana. As the Diana Award ceremony approached, excitement buzzed in the air. Celebrities, philanthropists, and influencers were expected to gather to honor the young recipients and celebrate the legacy of Princess Diana. Meghan and Harry, who have become synonymous with humanitarian efforts and stepping back from royal duties, were anticipated to play a significant role in the event. However, in a surprising twist, they were left off the guest list. This snub was not just a minor oversight. It resonated deeply with Meghan, who has long fought to establish her own identity outside of royal confines. For her, this was more than a mere invitation. It was a validation of her efforts to carry forward Diana's legacy. Reports say that Meghan Markle was visibly upset upon hearing the news. Friends close to the couple revealed that Meghan had hoped to use the platform to highlight her advocacy for women's rights and mental health, causes that align closely with her late mother-in-law's mission. The snub felt like a personal affront, particularly considering the couple's commitment to philanthropy. In the past, Meghan has expressed her struggles with being in the public eye and the scrutiny that comes with it. This incident appeared to reignite her frustrations, leading to the strong emotional response that caught many off guard. Meghan's determination to be a voice for the voiceless often clashes with the royal institution's rigid protocols, leaving her in a precarious position. The fallout from this incident has been significant. Media outlets quickly picked up the story, and discussions around the snub intensified. Supporters of the couple rallied on social media, voicing their disappointment over the perceived slight. Many argued that Meghan and Harry's contributions to charity should have been acknowledged with an invitation to the ceremony. On the flip side, critics seized the opportunity to question their relevance in royal affairs. The split opinions showcased the polarizing nature of Meghan and Harry's relationship with the media and royal family. While some view them as modern-day champions of change, others see them as renegades who have distanced themselves from their royal heritage. This incident highlights a more significant issue within the royal family, the challenge of balancing tradition with modernity. Meghan and Harry's journey has shed light on the complexities of royal life in the 21st century. They represent a new generation of royals who aspire to connect with the public on a personal level, breaking away from the formalities that have historically defined the monarchy. The snub at the Diana Award event raises questions about how the royal family perceives and engages with its members who choose to forge their own paths. It underscores the tensions that exist within the institution and the need for evolution in how the royal family interacts with the modern world. In light of this incident, Many are calling for greater recognition of individuals who embody the spirit of Princess Diana. The Diana Award is not merely a trophy. It's a testament to the impact young people can have on society. Meghan and Harry's involvement would have amplified the message of compassion and service, reminding everyone of the importance of giving back. 
The snub serves as a reminder that even in the face of adversity, it's crucial to stay committed to one's values. Megan's passion for humanitarian work continues to shine through, even when met with challenges. Her ability to advocate for change persists, and her voice remains vital in today's discourse about social issues. As the dust settles on this latest media frenzy, it's essential to consider what lies ahead for Meghan Markle and Prince Harry. The couple has navigated a tumultuous journey filled with both triumphs and tribulations. With their focus on mental health, social justice, and community empowerment, they continue to inspire many. While the Diana Award snub may have been disheartening, it is unlikely to deter Meghan and Harry from their mission. They have proven time and again that their commitment to making a difference transcends any royal title or accolade. Their resilience in the face of adversity is a testament to their character and determination. The saga surrounding Meghan Markle's reaction to the Diana Award snub encapsulates the complexities of royal life. 